Hi hey, everyone and welcome back to some more Civilization 5. So, I'm not quite ready to go to war with Monty just yet. I think I'll wait for Radar to unlock heavy bombers and actual fighters. We'll see. We also need more fighters in general. We have a whole one triplane right now. I got another one queued up in Azor, but two triplanes are probably also not quite enough. I'm just saying. An event has ended. Alright then. Doesn't say what event. Okay, whatever. Anyway, new policy. We can get a level 3 tenet. Which one do we want? Earth Supremacy sounds quite nice, actually. We will receive a free airport in every city. So that will make airlifting much easier. And it will also give us a lot of extra tourism. Because airports have a tourism bonus. And we'll get plus 25% production bonus when building air units. And we'll be able to build zeros. I like this. I think we'll take that one. Plus 50% tourism to civilizations fighting a common enemy. Yeah, that's not quite useful against the Aztecs. Let's take Earth Supremacy. That is quite good. And what's our tourism now? 311. Nice. Look at how far ahead we are. So next thing we need to do is repeal the tourist ban. So we'll see about that. Oh, there's a sanction attempt on us. Well, that's not going to succeed. We got 17 votes. But hey, bonus points for trying. Anyway, can we build zeros right away? Or do we need... yeah, first we need the tech. Radar. Yep, fair enough. That's fine. So, what else can we do around here? You can go into the city, that's fine. As for the worker, let's build one more road section right here. So that we'll be able to move around a little bit faster. Regular road will be fine, we don't need a railroad. And then we'll keep working on the road connecting the cities to our core territory. Just build a railroad, that's good enough. We need a few more sections. So, railroad. This one is done. Alright then. So, let's keep moving. Further west. I'm just moving towards Monty, basically. And what about all the artillery around here? I think I'll keep them in this general area for now, but I'll grab the plus one range ones. So this guy has plus one range, and this guy also has plus one range. We'll move them towards Monty. They will be more useful over there. Yep. Off you go then. You can stay around here. Inside the city is fine. Okay, looking good. Plus one population. What's the priority here? Production. Yep, keep it on production. We need to get Valetta back. Shaka built his own corporation. Alright, good for him. So, how about a diplomat? In Salvador, maybe? Hey, hold on, I think we have one coming in Sao Paulo or something, no? Well, let's get one then. It will take four turns. Four turns is fine. Okay, sounds good. And another negative event. Why am I not surprised? Okay, fine. We lost some food. That's acceptable. Oh, and we got a panzer. Nice. That's from the city-state. And we can airlift now, thanks to the tenant we just picked up. So there's no need to move all the way west. We can just airlift. That's exactly what we're going to do. Oh, that's going to be so amazing. Monty doesn't stand a chance now that we can airlift all the way. I'm not going to war just yet, but this will be massive help. We'll be able to reinforce this area so much easier now. Way, way easier. Alright then. So, a few more railroad sections over here, and then we'll need one more. Let's go. And what about the other artillery? Yep, this one. This one has plus one range too. So, airlift. You can move over like this. Alright, airlift. Oh yeah, he already moved, right? 
Yes, he already moved on this turn. No, he didn't. Here, off you go. There, done. So, anything else? We'll just chill in this general area. The machine gun also has plus one range. That will come in handy for sure. And the panzer. We can airlift that too. What do these guys have? Plus 25% combat bonus when defending. Alright. Oh, and plus 15% combat strength in friendly territory. Because we control the Himeji castle. Shock 1, shock 2. And let's airlift. Off you go. Next. He has tanks, he has infantry. He definitely has air units by now. Which is why I want to wait for radar. And a few more fighters. We got one queued up in Nassau. We can queue up some more maybe. In Sao Paulo, after the diplomat. Maybe after the hotel. I want that for some extra tourism. And in Rio? What's Rio doing right now? Research lab? Yeah, let's queue up a triplane after the research lab, but that's fine. Alright then. And we should probably spread our region west. Yeah, I think so. Let's buy some Inquisitors. And to this city. Alright, let's buy a few Inquisitors. And then we can airlift Inquisitors, because why not? I don't see why not. That will do for now. Okay then, we might also need actual missionaries. We'll see. We probably will. Anyway, diplomat. We still need more influence in this city. The Aztecs are very, very close behind. And I want to maintain our alliance with this one. That's actually kind of important for when we go to war. Disembark. And the cargo ship. Let's take a look. Where do we send it? Probably to Shaka. We are close enough to send it to Shaka. Sounds good to me. We can spread our franchise to Shaka. How many franchises do we have right now? Three. Okay, but we are working on more. We should get more in the next 15, 20 turns. I still want Valetta back. But the diplomat is coming. When is the next vote happening? In 11 turns. Okay, that should be fine then. Not too worried about that. Carry on with the mosques. And now we can airlift the Inquisitors. Sounds good to me. Airlift. We are not very far away, but there's no reason not to airlift. Here you go. And one more. There, done. Alright then. Another negative effect? Yep. Minus 360 food. Fine. I can live with that. Here's another tank. Might as well airlift it. Because why the heck not? Here, more units. How's our supply limit? 24 out of 82. Right. Looks reasonable. There's the road. We connected Saguntum. Now we can repair. And connect the oil. Not that we need more oil, but might as well connect it. No reason not to. Right, Inquisitors. Let's remove the heresy. Yeah, we will need actual missionaries, which is fine. We have the fate. That's not really a problem. We'll need several. Here, we can only afford two right now. So remove heresy. And that's that. Okay, we converted one. The other two will require a missionary. Alright then. Works for me. Artillery is here. 
And the road is almost done. It will be done in a few turns. That will increase our happiness and income by a lot. Because we are getting a pretty significant isolation penalty right now. So that will fix it. And we'll get a lot more gold per turn. Our economy is not looking so great considering we are in the middle of the carnival right now. But I'm not exactly worried about the economy. Not really, it will be fine. So, what about you? Do we need anything else around here? Maybe an improvement? This is in range. Yeah, we can get a lumber mill or a mine that looks like a hill. Convert Vilnius. There you go. And move the missionaries. One more. Okay. We'll get a few more once we get more faith. Production. Research lab is done. Nice. We still need a hotel in this one. So let's grab a hotel. And then probably hospital. Sounds good. I think we'll be going for a culture victory. We just need to repeal the travel ban. And maybe get some great musicians. This would be a good moment to start getting great musicians. And we should send some trade routes as well. Yep. I don't think we can get open borders. That seems unlikely, but we can try. With Shaka. It's incredibly so unlikely. We don't even have an embassy with Shaka right now. He won't no. accept an embassy in the first place. Can we get a trade? Um a decent trade of any kind? Kulum. Okay. It looks fair to me. But he's not interested. Does he want any strategic resources? Some. Aaron. We have a lot of that. Yeah, this is a very weird deal. But we have 83 oil. We might as well trade some of it. Yeah, this looks like... Well, it's not a reasonable trade, but we can't really trade with anyone else. So... Yeah, alright, let's just do it. It's fine. So, yo. I think we're done here. We got all the workers we need, so we can send him back. Off you go. And now we just need a few more turns. To finish the railroad. We just need two more sections right now. And then we need actual railroads. Because I'd like to get the production bonus too. Not just connect to the trade network. So we'll work on that. Here you go. There's the diplomat. Send him to Valletta. And we somehow got Valletta back. Wait, what? How did that happen? Uh, that makes no sense. Interesting. Oh, do we have a spy in there? No. That's a little bit weird. Hey, I don't mind. Let's maybe send the diplomat to Sofia. We probably finished some quest. By accident. That's probably what happened. They want us to acquire the Aztec capital. Speaking of which, let's see what's going on in here. Wait, what? He's building an arsenal. How did he not have an arsenal in his capital? That's strange. Okay, that is actually pretty strange. What does he have in here? Yeah, quite a few wonders. Good for him. Pestilence, again. Yeah, why am I not surprised? Plus one population in Saguntum. Sounds good. And we are losing some gold now. Probably a good moment to start building stock exchanges. Let's get that Chancery though. Chancery, Constabulary and then Stock Exchange. Sounds good to me. And Lumber Mill. And you can go work on the railroads. Yep. Now, Missionary. Let's spread to Vilnius first. And then, well, we don't have much of a choice, do we? And nope, we do not. That was not enough, apparently, really. 
Well, this was enough. Not enough faith to buy our unique building. Or rather, the... Stupa. Yeah, let's buy that and then... We'll save up for more missionaries and inquisitors. Now, we also need to upgrade this road to a railroad. It will be worth it for all the extra production we'll get out of it. It will just take a little bit of time. Alright then. So, this road is done. Now let's do some upgrades. It will cost us a little bit of extra maintenance, but we are about to connect, what, six cities to our trade network? That will be worth a lot. And you. Yep, over here. Vilnius first. Looks good. Next. Five more turns to finish radar. Do we have a great scientist coming anytime soon? Let's take a look. Musicians. Oh, we got a great musician coming in four turns. We could use him to increase our tourism against the Aztecs. 30 turns for a great scientist. We can speed that up a little bit if we want to. Probably worth it. Let's use manual priorities here. We'll assign the scientists like this. How's the production in this one? 181. Pretty low. And we will get a great engineer eventually. So let's keep working on that. We can always use him for a manufactory, if nothing else. Here. How's that? One more. Actually, two more. This will be fine. 200 production. The city will still grow. And engineer in 22 turns, scientist in 15 turns. Looks good to me. Let's queue something up after radar. I'm thinking atomic theory and radio. Or we could go all the way to mobile tactics. Now that's not a bad idea. Unlock mechanized infantry. That is quite tempting, but I would really like to know where uranium is on the map. And if we want to win a culture victory, we should really unlock the broadcast tower by now. Yeah, we need broadcast towers if we want culture victory. So, missionary. Vilnius. Spread one more time. And then we'll need another inquisitor, I guess. There's the diplomat. How's the gap? It's still not as big as I would like it to be. We can also get Buenos Aires, though. I would really like to do that. Let's buy a diplomat, that's 700. We can afford that. And we'll grab Buenos Aires. And then queue up another diplomat to strengthen our influence. Maybe even two diplomats. Yeah, that looks reasonable. If we are going to recruit so many diplomats, we should get wired service in here. Because that's plus 20% production to diplomatic units. But that requires quite a lot of hammers. So maybe another time. Yep, another time. Now we'll need an Inquisitor. So that requires more faith, I suppose. Alright. Let's switch off auto-purchase. I can just auto-purchase the Inquisitor. I mean, we can airlift him anywhere we want. But I'd rather just buy him directly. Over here. Asor. There's the triplane. Well, let's grab another triplane. We are going to need more than just two fighters. Oh, hi. Barbarians, again. Same exact spot as before. Well, alright. Doesn't really matter all that much. Hey, we can use the triplane against it. Because why not? Plus one interception. That is nice. Here. So. Sofia. Just to make sure it will stay on our side. There's the zoo. So, Vilnius. We could grab a hotel. To increase our tourism a little bit. Or we could start recruiting a diplomat. Yeah, let's grab a diplomat. 
We need to make sure these city-states will stay on our side. Attila actually wants a deal. And he actually has the money. I'm kind of shocked, actually. Well then, sure. You can have it. You can even have more than one. There you go, 11. Salt, copper, jade. He has 35 gold per turn. Way more than I thought he will. Here, 29 gold per turn. That's a pretty good deal. Shaka is plotting against you. That's not exactly surprising. He's Shaka after all. He can plot all he wants. It's not going to work. Asor can fire... Oh, yeah, right, that's the barbarians. They won't get very far. But they did pillage the thirds. Which is not very nice. Here. Done. Let's grab a worker. Okay. Oh, and we still got some tiles that require repairs. So you guys can go handle that. And you there. Off you go. Do we have any more spare workers around here? We got a few idle workers. They haven't been doing anything. This guy is done. We can connect the oil now. Any more workers? Yep, one over here. Let's send him this way. And start working on Buenos Aires. We need one more guy. And that will give us Buenos Aires. Or rather, alliance with them. That should do it. Yep, nice one. Plus on population. Rio is up to 31, not bad. Not bad at all. Next. When is the next vote? How many more turns? Six more turns. Alright then. I will probably use all my votes to vote against the sanctions. I can't afford to get sanctioned, that would be a disaster. Absolutely not. Here, we got Buenos Aires. Very nice. And is it done yet? It looks like it's done. I think the connect- no, the connection's kicked in. Here, yep, they are all connected now. Nice. Up to 67 happiness. And now we can work on the railroads. To get the production bonus. That's the plan. Negative event again. Yep. Okay. We lost some food. I can live with that. Repair the thirds. And there's the triplane. Just rebase it all the way west. We only need two more turns to get radar. So. Repairs. Let's work on that. First, the actually important things. So, great style improvements. These are way more valuable. Hotel. Alright then, 216 hammers. That's pretty decent. Now let's get stock exchange. We need to improve our income. We still got 30 more turns of the carnival, but I would like to get more than 20 gold per turn, you know? Just saying. You can also work on this. Alright, next. I think right now Carthage is only connected through a harbor. Yep. Which is fine, but I do want a road. Oh, great. Now we have to take the first option. Okay, then. Well, alright. Did anything get pillaged? Not seeing it. Another one. Pestilence. And another one. Seriously now? What the heck? Three negative events in one turn. That's a bit of an overkill, don't you think? Because I certainly do. The city is starving. Okay then. No, it's not. It's fine. So, get to work. You guys will chill around here. And let's get started on repairs. That's going to be a lot of repairs. And I guess we should build a railroad through here. But maybe later. The cities are connected to our trade network, that's what matters. That's a manufactory, I think. Or is it? Academy. Yeah, that is obviously useful, though. There you go. 
One more turn. And we'll have to spend some gold. Monty is still keeping units on the border. Wellington election rigged, that's our own spy. There, we got radar. And a great musician. I don't think we can get open borders from the Aztecs. Uh, no, obviously not. But once we go to war, we can use the musician. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, he's worth just under 7,000 tourism right now. That's probably good enough. So I would say through here will be best. Okay, we'll just keep him in there. But need to remember he's actually there to begin with. So, one more diplomat and caravan. Not much point sending a caravan to Monte. We'll just send it to the city state, that's good enough. How expensive is the upgrade? 1200. Well, alright. Same for the bomber. That will be a lot of gold, but that will give us a really nice advantage. I can't see any air units in his cities, but he definitely has some. He's building a seaport right now. He definitely has some, he has to. Research lab is almost done. I don't think we need an arsenal in this city. Could still build one, but I don't think that's really necessary. We could build a prora, oh that's useful. Uh, hold on, we got better cities for that. We definitely do. Like Sao Paulo. 11 turns. Yep, let's do it. We don't have any competition for it, do we? I'm pretty sure we don't. We just unlocked it recently, right? What's the requirement for that? No, that requires flight. Pretty sure that wasn't there earlier. Alright. Doesn't say how many policies it requires. Well, in any case, we will definitely build that. I don't think we have any competition for that, because nobody else went autocracy. Yep, it's just us with autocracy. Look at the tourism gap, but we need to repeal the travel ban. Otherwise, this is going to be rough. One more upgrade. Interception 1, Interception 2. And let's take a Reaper on this guy. And obviously upgrade. What else? Wired service? Maybe. That's plus two culture and plus two science. Plus two culture for every city-state friend and plus two science for every city-state ally. That is worth it still. Let's build that. Sven turns is not too bad. And one more promotion needed. Alright, we still got 5,000 left, so we should be fine. Keep working on that. There you go. Hopefully no barbarians will show up. But we got some units nearby. Next. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say. How's that vote? Three more turns. I do want world religion, but I really don't want to get sanctioned. We'll have to vote against the sanctions. I can't afford to get sanctioned just now. What do you want next? Let's take a look. I would say maybe some units. Some infantry wouldn't hurt. Yeah, we don't have that many melee units, so that definitely won't hurt. Maybe we can make the city grow a little bit faster. Uh, we can. Let's switch it to food and then we can switch back to production. Yep. There's the research lab. Oh, hold on, now we can get the zeros. Right. How long would that take? Eight turns. Let's get at least one. Alright, let's get at least one. Sounds good to me. Now the main question is how long do we want to wait before we declare war on Monty? 
I don't want to wait too long. What the heck is this? Aztec Gorilla, alright. So what after the research lab? I'm actually thinking stock exchange. Yep, to improve our economy a little bit. We need to focus on that. So, move the fighter. All the way west. And move the bomber. Having an airport in every single city is pretty amazing. Now we can have up to 10 air units in any city we want. That's a lot of air units. So, more repairs, obviously. And actually, that's going to be the end of this episode. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did, or a dislike if you didn't. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.